Hello TK based animation tool for viewing network simulation traces and then real world packet traces. And using this, uh, we can uh, make our uh, topology layouts, packet, packet level animations, and other data inspection tools also we can use. And then we have to, in first, we have to install this NAM. <clears throat> the command for that is apt hyphen get. See apt hyphen get or just apt. Both are sufficient. In the latest versions of Ubuntu, you, if you write only apt, that is sufficient. So apt hyphen get space install space hyphen y hyphen y is for yes. If you this is an option. If you don't give this hyphen y, then later on it will ask whether you want to proceed. Then you have to press y. And if you give y here, then it will not ask you. It will directly install. And NAM, N A M, NAM, APT space hyphen get, APT get space install space hyphen Y space NAM, press enter. And it will install NAM on your device. Yeah, proceed, give this command. In my device, it is already installed. So I'm not firing this command. Yes, done. OK, very good. It's showing a resource temporary and available. OK. Uh, you remember last time I told you the command to, if that APT is uh, busy, it's not uh you uh, to kill that apt resource you remember that ma'am uh, it is showing that uh, unable to locate package nam unable to locate packet nam to be we have to just install this now ma'am same uh it is showing me that only unable okay to or oh, it's downloading over here. Yeah, it's downloading. See, it should download. Uh, if it is giving you error, then you remember that command uh, ps space hyphen uh, hyphen a or uh, grape apt. <clears throat> Give this command. And then see, right now this apt is not work, uh, running for me. If it is giving error, you get here apt or aptd and with that you will get process id okay then you kill that command using that kill space hyphen nine space that pid whatever process id you are getting and press enter so if you're getting error use these two commands to resolve and then again try how to check if it's installed or not uh, just give nam command Okay, so those who are getting error, give these two commands. And after that, again, fire that command for apt hyphen get installed. Excuse me, ma'am. Ma'am, it's a command line option. G from get is not understood in combination with the other options. Then, then just give apt. apt space. Just give this command apt install hyphen y and nam nam hmm? after installation we have to uh, fire the nam command just nam command so that you can know that you're ma'am i'm getting a segmentation fault yeah ma'am see okay yeah yeah it's okay we uh, this will uh, show when we will uh, have that ns2 also no we are right now having only nam okay? yes ma'am so i'm getting the same yes yes it's okay hmm. so this nam is installed yes ma'am okay so next is to install ns2 the command is apt install 
hyphen by ns2 ns2 so apt install hyphen y ns2 so fire this command and then it should install ma'am now it is saying that cannot open the log file ha huh, that's all if it is giving the error na log file then you re uh, repeat these two commands that ps wala and this one okay give this command ps hyphen a or grape apt then you will get process id for this apt then use this kill command kill space hyphen 9 space that process id ma'am i'm still getting like unable to load it package look uh, are you connected to the network internet yes ma'am Mm, then it should not because it is downloading from the internet. Mm. How to say if it's installed? NS two. What? Uh, I didn't get. To, can you repeat? Ma'am, how to check if NS two is installed or not? Just give NS command. Okay, just give NS command, and see here this. percentage prompt came here yes ma'am ha uh, it means this ns2 is installed hello ha ma'am package i'm unable to locate package ma'am ma'am mm -hmm. after giving the uh, ps command uh, it is it is it is not showing me anything just an ubuntu dollar sign has come okay and still it is giving that error what error it is giving uh, ma'am uh, that uh, a log file uh, could not open a log file i will try it again ma'am just you see. try it again ha huh. okay yeah how to uh, like escape from the percentage uh control c <clears throat> Ma'am, again it is showing me the same. Cannot open log file. Mm. It should not give that error. See, if it uh, is it saying that APT is used by some other like that? No, ma'am. It is showing me could not open the log file uh, and uh, uh, unable to log the administration directory. Are you on the hash prompt? Sorry, ma'am. Are you on the hash prompt? uh no ma'am then oh yes yes see yes, yes. all the commands will not work on the dollar prompt you should be on the hash prompt okay, okay. So before that you give the sudo space su space hyphen wala command okay ma'am hmm. yes ns2 installed yes ma'am yes ma'am okay so now this we use tcl script for tcl script we have to write a program so for writing the program we need editor so we can use nano editor we can use v editor uh, whatever is the device is working for you okay so we can install that or we can use that so we have to create file with the dot tc extension okay so see i'm giving ls command here you can see these tcl files are there at dot cl dot tcl like that na so we have to create a tcl file and then we have to write a code in that so first i'm i'm using nano editor it's nano editor is available in my this if it is not available then you can use vi editor or you can use g edit but again the syntax and the commands will be different there okay whatever you are using or otherwise you can install also like using this apt install hyphen y and nano or g edit or vi whatever okay so i am using nano i think it is available with everybody so nano this is the editor name space file name dot tcl i am giving test dot tcl okay you can give any name Better you your name dot tcl so that is easy to identify the file. So you give nano space your name 
dot tcl then a new editor will open here you can write the code and then these are the options uh, using control o you have you can save uh, using uh, control x you can exit all these are options are available with this okay so everybody is able to open this file dot tcl file created this file yes, okay so here i'm just uh, writing a simple program so here whatever you want to set a value that word is set then variable and i want to assign value 20 to this variable a so i'll set use set space a base 20 it is a case sensitive it is a space sensitive okay this language is space sensitive so we are setting a variable a to 20 now take another variable and writing setting the value it to 30 okay now what i want that i want to add both the values and store in third variable so set c now inside c space and here what we have to assign in the c we have to assign the value of a plus b so for that we have to write expression expr expression because the next variable we have to dollar dollar a plus dollar b and close this square bracket so what we are doing we are adding the value which is at a and value which is at b using this expression and assigning the value returned by this expression to c and then to print anything the command is puts puts and the what we want to print put we want to put the value at c so dollar at c are you able to write this program This is a very simple basic program where we are taking two variables, assigning some values, adding those values and assigning to third variable and printing that third variable. Yes, are you able to write this program? Yes, ma'am. Yes, everybody has written. Yes, now we will save this program using control a oh sorry control o control plus o and now it will ask file name to write so we will keep the same name tcl dot test dot tcl so pre just press enter control o and enter so that content whatever we written in this file are saved control o plus enter now we want to exit from here and go back to terminal so control x so we came back to this terminal here again now here we will give command to execute that file so for that command is ns file name dot tcl so file name i gave test dot tcl and i got this result Yes, is everybody getting output? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Okay. So now if I say write a program to print hello world just hello world can you write what will be the steps i just want you to write a simple program which prints hello world that's all nothing else i want in that so what will be the steps create a file using nano file name dot tcl then that file will open then there which which command you will use to print or display something puts puts and in the inverted commas hello world save it using control o 
enter control x to come out and no, ms how to use the existing file like now we have created test.pcl so how will we use it again if you want to you open it again using nano file or file name .tcl that will open again you can edit if i give the repeat same command that the file is open na now here i can type whatever i want ma'am it's still showing a uh, package not found for in for installing ns2 mm for installing ns2 also or nam yes ma'am both 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 okay you are on the dollar prompt or hash prompt hash prompt hash prompt ah oh, packet not found okay wait here on the ubuntu right click and uh, check the settings go into the settings and just see what are my settings are there you just make those settings this network adapter keep it nat okay so maybe because and, uh, hmm it's kali linux ma'am but it should still work ma'am uh in ns then we have to check in kali whether ns2 is supported or ns3 is supported yes ma'am uh, it's supported Yes. Then, then, then you Google search the steps to install uh, NS2 on uh, Kali. Command might be different there. Ah, uh, tried that man. Then, because in Kali, we can give the network adapter is bridged also. Bridged also, I know that. But and if you uh, want to print something, will it be in quotations or not? It it will be in the quotation. If you want to print as it is, in the double quotes. Hmm. Should also be in brackets. No, no, not in brackets. Only in double quotes. <clears throat> See, in bridge also you can use, and you can use it NAT. So in the NAT, I'm using because I'm trying. I'm just want to use the host IP address. I don't want to give a different IP address to this machine. So that's why I'm using this NAT setting. Okay. So that's why if my device, that my physical machine is connected to the network, na internet, then definitely this uh, internal machine will also connect it. So that's why I have kept it as a net setting. Hmm. How many students are having that unable to locate NS2? Ma'am, <laughs> even Raj, you, you are also using Kali? No, ma'am, Ubuntu. Ubuntu, okay. Mitesh, Rahul, okay. Ah. Oh. You can try the sudo apt hyphen get if you are not on the hash prompt. If you are on the hash prompt, then the sudo is not required. Okay, so sudo apt get in few devices just apt is sufficient. In few devices, you need uh, uh, apt hyphen get. You try different variations. Ma'am, can you show first code which you have given us a nano uh, space and then text dot tcl. File dot or tcl. Yes, ma'am. See this is this nano file name dot tcl. Yes, ma'am. After that, we have to write the code now for that. Yes, yes. The code is in this file. This file you are asking. Yes, ma'am. Wait a second. Yes, ma'am. See in few devices, those who are getting uh, this error now, uh, unable to locate. Sometimes what happens now? This this NS2 is not in that cache. So what we have to do? We have to download. Ma'am, ma I have restarted my, मतलब Ubuntu वाला मतलब window तो मतलब फिर work करने लग गया. 
Okay, okay. See, different strategies work on different things because I can't see your screens right now. What's going on there? <laughs> okay, so you only have to do this error and trial method. Um, what to do next? I have written the code this. Yeah, uh, control do. control O plus enter. Control O. Mm, yes, plus ma'am. enter. Control O enter. Huh, yes, now con control X. Control X. Hmm. Yes, ma'am. Then, ah, uh, then, ns file name dot tcl. Ns. Yes, ma'am. Got that. Got that. Yes, ma'am. Hmm. Yes, ma'am. So the students, those who are still facing the error, uh, what you can do with the error, whatever you are getting now, you just copy paste that error and Google search it. You will get the steps, the commands, uh, what you are missing, because everybody is having a different machines, different configurations. So few things which work, which are working on my machine might not work on your machine, and so few things which are working on your machine might not work in my machine. So you will get multiple options for that. Okay. You try that way, or sometimes we need to update the repository also. Okay, so uh, you just give command apt update, but that update will take time. Okay, sometimes we need to update that repository cache. So for that to update, the command is apt update, but it takes time. It will update. Uh, multiple packages okay so you try other ways if it will, it will work so the problem of any students got resolved so when it is configured hmm. When configured in this sound right version of DC. See, okay, how to upgrade. Don't upgrade TCLS, just update your uh, repository cache. APT update. That will update your system, okay? If still it is not working now, then uh, you have to download that TCLSH packet keep it in this path and uh, in this path you have to keep and then you have to untar it unzip it and then you have to use it because if it is not working the right way in the correct way which we are trying that way Okay, so are you able to write the program for Hello World? Yes, no? Anyone got output? Yes, I've got it. Yes, I've got it. Okay, okay, very good. So those who are not able to do it, will I'll show you that Nano TCL test one. I'm taking uh, creating a file test one dot TCL. So here simply i will write puts then whatever you want to print hello world and close it and then save it using control o enter control x and run it ns using file name dot tcl hello world okay this is the output
So now I'm showing you template. For that experiment, you are going to submit. Okay. So you have to write experiment. Experiment number. Okay. Then you have to write aim of the experiment. After that, theory. In theory part, we are using networking command. Okay, so here two or three lines about the introduction of networking commands. Like what are networking commands? After that, you have to give command. Suppose uh, you are giving command if config the command name, and then you have to write. Description of that command, at least, uh, which explains the purpose of this if config command. Okay, so a description of if config command. Okay, then what are the options which are available? Options like I told you, na uh, hyphen n hyphen like this, na. Uh, options are like hyphen n why we use hyphen n why we use hyphen i like this okay these options are available with this commands okay and then screenshot or copy paste of the command output which you gave okay screenshot of command execution command Execution. So when you gave, suppose this here, <clears throat> I'm giving if config command. So if config command. Okay. So this output I got. So I need this thing, this to be copy pasted there. Okay. This thing I want to be copy pasted there. Okay. So in this Word document, this will not work. You cannot bring these things out. Okay. This is not going to work because here this is another machine. I'm copying in virtual machine and trying to paste it outside. That is not going to work. So here it is a this is a LibreOffice writer. So this is a similar to our Word document sort of thing. So here only you have to copy paste. So this command ka output you have to paste. Well, we can copy the uh, lines in settings. Yes, yes. Yes, yes. If you change the setting, then you change the setting. You can. Okay. Both options are open for everybody. Whatever the best way you can do. Can you, you can put do. a snip, in, snip of the output if you want? Uh, yes, 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 yes. You can put, you can copy paste that output or you can put uh, snapshots uh, using snipper or a screenshot, whatever you want in any way. Okay. But I just want ki jo output aya command ka, that should be there. Okay. So this is a, for one command, then the next command. So this is your like first command, first networking command. Then your second networking command, whatever is networking command. And so this description, you can take it from the Google or you can take it from the man, man space hyphen command, or man space command name. You will get the description there also. So you can take this description and optional thing from the Google or from using the man command and then the second command, then third command like that. So this is how you are going to prepare the document for experiment number one. Okay. Then for experiment number two, so what you have to do, you have to write aim same way. Then theory. In theory, first you have to write introduction to NS2. Like what is NS2? Then introduction to PCL script. Okay. Introduction to PCL script. These things you have to write. 
and after that installation steps of ns2 so in the installation again if you give command like uh, you give apt install ns2 and then after that you got some output now so snapshot of that output after every command whatever commands or the steps you followed to install that so that the command and the snapshots so commands and snapshots then after that installation you created that two programs introduction uh, of that uh, tcl and uh, hello programming that hello hello world so copy paste that command like which you gave nano then file name dot tcl and after that the code which you wrote there the code written in tcl file that code here and after that when you gave this command ns file name dot tcl and you got output the snapshot of that output snapshot of output okay for both the files here the first file which i gave you program simple program and then second program which you wrote using uh, hello world okay and in the end conclusion in conclusion you are you are supposed to write like what you learned from this experiment okay whatever you learned from this experiment that you have to write and conclusion should be in the every experiment this is how you have to prepare document for both uh, experiments experiment number 1 and experiment number 2 and then you have to upload that document with your uh, name your uh, serial number and your class in the header included in your header and on the classroom Yeah. Any doubt? Ma'am, can you please show the format once again? Yes, you can see. This is. I think it is visible. Ma'am, can you repeat what options is in experiment one? What options is like options that? like with every command we have options, na? So here, if I give info, I get search help from for the IF config. So IF config, okay. So this man IF config here. See, these are the options like this, na? Synopsis verbos y hyphen a hyphen s hyphen v hyphen i. Okay, so these are different uh, options available with every command. With some commands we use hyphen n. With some we use hyphen i. Okay, these options are available. See, these are the options: hyphen a, hyphen s, hyphen v. Okay, the interface up, down. Okay, so these are options. Hmm. Okay. Hmm. So these these are options. See right? this a s this these things. Like uh, that uh, in the installation, I used uh, hyphen y na. That is an option. Okay. You have installed, uh, मतलब uh, ns ns two and uh, name command, and I am not. Uh, Taken a screenshot of that, and I log out. So how to get that? That type the command only that this command I used. And if even if you will give that command again, na. So if it is already installed, you will get output. Okay. Yeah, I also, yeah, I also repeated that command, na. So we will get that output. So whatever okay. you are getting that output, you take that snapshot. Yes. Any doubt? Is this clear? What you are supposed to do? Yes, ma'am. 
okay so now you prepare both the document uh, you have to repeat all the commands of previous experiments and next time onwards you just keep this in mind whatever command you are executing now you are firing now you take a snapshot or screenshot you and uh, copy paste dump into some word document there and then later on that theory thing you can write before those snapshots okay so you don't have to repeat how many options we need to mention see with the commands there are not so many options only few commands have lots of options so if any command is having lots of options then you can refer five six okay and if it is having only five six say the four five options then you you go for all okay so i'm preparing uh, i'll prepare there to experiment one and two submission of classroom 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 i'll prepare uh, two assignments experiment one and two so before this now i am giving you almost one hour for preparing this document so by four o'clock everybody prepare the document both the experiments and upload it there on the classroom okay can we get the commands again for the previous experiment first experiment Mm, mm, mm. I have shared. I have the, still, I feel like I have missed out some commands. Yes, yes. Recording. I think recording. I have shared of that session in the classroom. Why should why next week submission? Right now we have one hour, na, Vichcha. Some lecture is still three thirty. Lecture is still three thirty. Why? It's from two o'clock, na. Two to four, na. Lab. No ma'am. No ma'am. Three thirty. Ma'am, ma'am. And ma'am, direct second year is also having lectures. Okay. But uh, please the, extend the time. Okay, uh, but I didn't get uh, this information. Okay, I'll ask. See, but uh, okay, one experiment for one experiment, half an hour is sufficient. One experiment, you can finish. The second experiment, we can. Finish. Like, can we take our day today? But what you will do now? Uh, you are having half an hour. What you will do? We will start. We will start, we'll start, start doing, doing it. it. Okay. Ma'am, for experiment one, we need to do it. Okay. Then what you can do? You can keep. You can do the second one experiment. It, it it is not having many many steps. Okay. But still, I'll give you time. I won't cut your marks, even if you submit by tomorrow. But try to submit at least finish at least one experiment. Right now we have half an hour. Okay. Ma'am, and the TCL code, can we like take a snapshot and do it, or we have to type it in Word? You can copy paste. You can take snapshot. It's your choice. Completely your choice. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Yeah. Hello, ma'am. Yes. For that option, also we have to take snapshot. No, no. You can copy paste. You ask Google, na. See, rather than going uh, uh, taking help from man, you search that command and options, command description from the Google. So it will be easier for you to copy paste. Yes, you can submit uh, both experiments by tomorrow, tomorrow evening.
Now see, I think you'll be able to do both the experiments by tomorrow. Do you have any issue in that? Ma'am, actually, uh, the direct stepping students exams are also coming, so we have to prepare for that. Mm, so right. I okay. Think, uh, Okay, okay, okay. So, okay, we can then give uh, more time. Okay, okay. Then, how much time you need that diploma oh. students? Then you will be able to submit both the experiments, diploma students. By Friday? Yes, ma'am. Okay. Okay, ma'am. Okay. Okay. Yeah. yeah, diploma students can upload both the experiments by Friday.
मैम हेलो हेलो मैम यस हेलो मैम आई हैव जस्ट नाउ इंस्टॉल्ड माय वीएम वेब सो व्हिच फाइल वी हैव टू टेक फॉर इंस्टॉलेशन ऑफ दिस फाइल और ऑटो इंस दिस इमेज फाइल और एफएलपी फाइल Uh, you have installed VMware, na? No? Yes. Oh, TXT file. No, I'm, no, I'm installing uh, Ubuntu. Hmm. I'm installing Ubuntu. So, which file we have to take? The configuration file. The three KB. The three KB. Three KB. Okay, three KB. Thank you, ma'am. Hello, ma'am. Yes. What is the aim of first experiment? Uh, it's in our uh, experiment list. Ma'am, where is the experiment list? Uh, classroom. Ma'am, I'm not getting. Not getting. Then I'll upload. If it is not there, I'll upload. What is there in syllabus theory and lab? Yes, you have to uh, attach the two bridge sheet. Present, ma'am. Sixty-five. Uh, Present, ma'am. Yeah. 